Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is part six of my tarot card series. So if you haven't seen my other tarot card videos, be sure to check them out on my channel. And if you don't already, feel free to follow me on all my social media, which I'll have linked in the description. Next up, we have the Empress. This card is associated with creativity, fertility, abundance, and nature. The Empress signifies a strong connection with feminine energy and may represent a mother figure or creative person in your life. The Empress represents abundance of all kinds and shows your capacity for supporting and caring for others as well as yourself. This card also urges you to connect more with nature in order to ground your energy and allow yourself the time to enter a different frame of mind. Reversed, this card is reminding you to nurture yourself as you may be spending too much time caring about others and neglecting your own needs. It could also also indicate a creative block. The Empress asks you to claim your own power and not let others define you. As I did in the previous video, I'm going to continue talking about the symbols from the original decks and how I took those and incorporated them into my own artwork. The first one I chose to incorporate was the crown of stars on top of her head. This basically shows her connection with the mystical realm and the cycles of the world being the 12 planets, the 12 zodiac signs. In the original deck, she's also wearing a robe patterned with pomegranates, which is a common symbol for fertility. The high priestess card from the original deck also has pomegranates in it, so it's again just like a common symbol for fertility, and both of these cards have very strong feminine energies attached to them. Lastly, one of the key elements from the original deck is that the Empress is sitting kind of in this very lush forest. There's uh, lots of trees in the background and there's wheat in the foreground to show her connection to the earth and to nature. And what I did with that, as you can see, is I kind of just made this design in the background with the wheat and the leaves to show her connection with the earth and represents her abundance. And if the feminine energy wasn't already slapping you in the face, there's also the Venus symbol. <laughs> we love that for her. And that's about it for the Empress. I really, really, really love how this one came out. I'm always afraid to do gold on top of a plain black background because I'm always scared of, I guess, the details and making sure that the gold stands out against the black. It's also really time consuming since I'm working on white paper and I don't want the gold to be on top of the black because then it can get dulled down. And I kind of cut it out of this video because it was such a boring thing to watch, but basically what I had to do was took the black first, went around every single design that I had drawn with the pencil, then did the gold and then fixed it back up with the black. It was just a ton of back and forth and um, it was extremely boring to watch. So that's why it's not in here. Um, but I really do love the end result. So it is worth it. <laughs> and that's about it for the Empress. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like it. Can't wait to hear what you think. If you like this art piece, I do have prints available in my Etsy shop. I had a few people ask me if I'm going to be selling the originals. I will be eventually, um, but for now I'm holding on to them because I still have a ways to go when I make the final deck and I want to have the official piece in case I need to photograph something again or you know change it up a little bit so for now I'm holding on to them they will be for sale eventually and of course I will let you guys know when they're available so for now just the prints um, which are on my Etsy shop and I'll have that linked in the description thank you so much for watching feel free to check out the other tarot card videos that I have up on my channel I can't wait to hear what you guys think and I'll see you in the next one bye